Hey guys, it's Mrs. Gato. I was thinking of Earth Week and some projects we could do. My son and I read this really fun story about the coral reefs and I was thinking of the ocean and then I remembered I saw this project a while ago and thought, why not do it? So what you need, friends, is a Ziploc baggie. I had this um, storing something and I used it and now I have the bag left over. But again, it's perfectly great bag. So even after this project is done, I'm gonna reuse it again. And then I had just a piece of black construction paper. And this, again, friends, you can reuse it because actually I'm not gonna do anything to this black construction paper, but just put it inside here. And with this project, I find that when you're writing on baggies like this, the best kind of markers are Sharpies. This is a permanent marker, but we have Sharpies too. And these are permanent, like I said. So if you get it on something, it's almost impossible to get it off. So make sure when you're doing this project, you check with mom or dad if you can use Sharpies or whoever's watching you, grandma, grandpa, if you can use Sharpies and where a good spot is for you to use them. So friends, what I did was on my plastic baggie, there's writing on the side. So I made sure I wrote on the side that didn't have the writing. I drew these fun sea creatures. I did a jellyfish and then all these little fish. And I did, this was supposed to be a shark, but it didn't turn out that way. And then I tried to make it into a dolphin and then it is what it is. And um, I did some, my version of a coral reef down here and then some starfish. And friends, you can do whatever you want. I did an underwater scene and made it look like it was night. You can do um, bugs and trees, animals, however you want to do it. But right now I'm making it look like it's nighttime and the fish are still swimming and they're all nice and calm. But it's hard to see these fish like this. So what I did was I grabbed a piece of um, paper for my copier and um, it was... Uh, I had printed something by mistake for my sons for his school and we really didn't need it. And I didn't want to throw that paper away. I wanted to make sure I used it because it was just one side that had something printed on it. So I flipped it over and I made this and it looks kind of like a funnel and it has a wide top and then it goes down and it's very narrow or thin. And I colored this top part top part of the top yellow. And then I put here, it's like my little secret on off button. So friends, this is on right now, and this is my flashlight. And I'll tell you friends, if you stick this in on top of the black paper, but into your baggie, look, you can really investigate all of your animals and make them look bright and see them better. Just like maybe you were underwater scuba diving and you have your flashlight. So very cool, friends. So again, make trees, make bugs, whatever you want. You play around with it and make it what you want it to be. I just decided to do an ocean scene. And guess what, friends? I can use this to make my to-do lists because I am a list maker. And I can put this back in my construction paper pile. So next time we need it, we have it. And this, I can store things in. Look, I can put my markers in here if I want to and I'm reusing it. So all these things we can reuse again. So just a fun project. Hope you enjoyed it and I miss you guys. I hope you're having a great time and happy Earth Day. Bye.